morning welcome back this is sierra and the position that i'm currently squatting in is incredibly uncomfortable that's not why you guys are here anyways um if you guys are watching this video it means one of two things either you're one of my subscribers which is awesome or you clicked on this video from my earlier stitch fix unboxing that I uploaded earlier this week or the last one you found me randomly on the search bar so you guys what we're going to be doing today we're going to be doing a little stitch fix unboxing try on I did the unboxing in my last video I'll put that up in the cards and also in the video description if you guys want to check it out um, otherwise if you're new around here my name is Sierra and I'm an American who lives in England that was hard for me to say because I used to live in Japan and I'm a little bit sad anyways um every week I make a video about the shenanigans that either I am up to or my family is up to during our life here I also make videos about vegan kids adoption living a more eco-friendly lifestyle and lush so if any of those things are interesting to you you know what to do hit the little bell and we'll see a lot more of each other anyways um kind of trying to talk fast here because I'm really not comfortable right now but um I'm gonna be trying on all the stuff that I unboxed in the last video so uh, let's get to it um, other thing I wanted to mention is that you guys are probably going to be hearing a little bit of humming in the background and a lot of echo in here because we just moved into this new house and there is literally no furniture in my entire office and slash filming room slash yoga room only thing i literally have in here is a mat on the floor two stuffed animals the clothes i'm wearing and I'm on the floor and my yoga mat which does not help very much so sorry about that guys anyways let's try some stuff on one more thing before i try this stuff on um you guys may notice that i'm wearing uh, what I call it the try-on uniform because I have a thing about ickiness and wearing clothes before I've washed them so I'm going to be wearing some leggings and just a white t-shirt to keep my skin from touching the clothes because you never know who tried it on before you. Anyways, let's try this on. First thing I'm going to be trying on is this white shirt that my stylist sent so let's see what that looks like. Okay, that first item is on and just at first glance it is super cute let's just kind of slowly step back so you can get a better idea of what it looks like it's just you know your basic tank top um but it has a lot of the um embroidery a little bit of lace and it's really cute i really like the colors a lot i think it's gonna look really cute with those red trousers that she sent me in my last fix um and just in general i think it's kind of a unique piece to kind of brighten up any wardrobe because i've it with jeans possibly a red skirt or something like that so that's pretty cute i like that so yeah, let's try something else. Change of plans. Since I'm already wearing this shirt underneath of it and I kind of want to see what it looks like with it anyway, I'm actually going to try on the blue sweater that she sent. Blue sweater's on. It also looks like I lost an earring. It's on the floor. Let's just, for simplicity, just take them out so this doesn't keep happening. Um, I actually made these a while ago um, with some Mops Mamas. We had a mom's night out, I think it was, and we made these little fake leather and sparkly leather feather earrings. They're really fun. Cute, not practical for trying on clothes. Anyways, so this is the blue sweater and it is on. Let's take a step back. And I mean, I don't know what to say about it. I actually think I have a shirt like this um, that I had like six years ago and it's like a, like more of like an oceany blue type color. And so I guess it's pretty much the same thing but in sweater form, but again, like, pretty cute not gonna lie and I actually do really like how it looks with this underneath of it so as I said before it would be pretty much perfect for wearing on days where it's cold in the morning and be warm later so that's exciting feeling kind of hot right now so let's take this off and try something else <laughs> hey there so I noticed you were doing kind of like a top theme so I figure I'm just trying all the tops now and we move on to the other stuff so as you guys can see I picked out the little periwinkle sweater so I'm gonna step back and we're gonna see how it looks I don't know what I think about it what do you guys think about this sweater? I feel like, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, it doesn't look bad, but like, it doesn't look like extra special or anything either. Oh, maybe I should actually like pull it down correctly. That'd probably help. Tell me what you guys think. It's just, you know, your basic sweater. Although I do really like that it's super soft. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty comfortable and cute. I just don't know what color bottoms I would wear this with, so. I don't know. If you guys have any ideas what color bottoms or what color dress skirts or shorts I should wear this sweater with, let me know. But yeah, I'm lost for words. All right, I'm dressed again. And as you guys can see, we're trying on the dress. Oh, that's attractive, isn't it? If I decide to buy this, I'll definitely have to make sure these are like tucked in or just cut them off. But yeah, this dress's sleeves are very interesting. I don't yet know what I think about them. What do you guys think about them? You guys probably want to see them in the back, don't you? What do you guys think? Pretty cute. Ooh, actually, you know what? Now that I'm looking closer to it, I don't think it's as cute as I thought it did. And here's why, because you guys see, like right here on the dress, 
where the print goes together, it's not even. So like here it should be like a flower. So I don't know. As someone who sews, I don't know what I think about that. So I guess I'll have to try it on a few more times. But overall, I like the color a lot when it comes to the way that it's printed and the fact that the flowers are not perfectly lined up and might drive me crazy every time I try to wear it. So we'll see about that. But yeah, we have one more thing to try on, and that's the cardigan. I really hope this is it, guys. Like, I've been looking for this black cardigan far too long, and it's kind of embarrassing. So hopefully this is the right one. I really hope that it is, so let's see what it's like. <laughs> Well, that took longer than necessary. Who knew a cardigan would be so complicated to get on just right? Okay, let's step back and see what we think from further away. By golly, I think we finally found it. I like the length too. I feel like it's really good because if I wanted to wear it with like some colored leggings on a not so cool day or maybe coming up this fall, I could do that and it covers my bootay. Because as you guys know, I'm on team leggings are not trousers, leggings are hosiery. So yeah, that is the end of my little Stitch Fix try on. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you'd like to try out Stitch Fix for yourself, at this point you probably know how it works. But um, the short version is basically what you do is you click on my referral link in the description. That link is gonna give you a $20 or more discount. It's also gonna give me the same discount when I go to shop just by you using the link and making an order. And then you just fill out the style quiz, decide where you want it shipped fill in your sizes and you're good to go so yeah um for me i feel like stitch fix has been really valuable because one i'm a mom and my son does not like to go clothes shopping with me and it's one less thing i have to do i also like that because of the pandemic it's more of a risk-free way to shop so if that's something that you're worried about or if you're in an area of the world where you're still on lockdowns you can still go shopping without leaving the house to go shopping so yeah i hope you guys liked this video if you guys want to see more of these please let me know in the comment section and also in the comment section tell me which items if you were me you would pick for me or what items you keep for yourself and that's it um like subscribe if you haven't already leave me a comment and i'll see you guys later thank you guys for watching bye